kids get back to school and folks heading back to work. Oh, it felt very much like summer over the weekend. Both days temperatures climbed into the middle 80s. We even broke the record yesterday. It's going to be another warm one today, though not quite as hot as the weekend. Radars quiet this morning over uh, Rhode Island, southeastern Massachusetts on live pinpoint Doppler 12. And as we take a look at our weather headlines, one more Warm one as temperatures today climb between 75 and 80 degrees. The record for the day I think we will not reach, which is 87 degrees. Where you have a backdoor front that we'll be tracking today. It'll move through by this evening and tonight, and behind it comes much cooler weather that'll settle in for midweek. And it's during that time in the Tuesday, Wednesday time frame where we could see maybe a spotty shower here and there, but it doesn't look like it'll be the beneficial rains that we could use less than a quarter of an uh, inch of rain expected with uh, lots of clouds accompanying the uh, change in the temperatures by tomorrow. For today, though, we're looking at a fairly mild start. You don't need a thick jacket. Temperatures will be in the upper 50s to lower 60s as you begin your Monday morning, 61 in Providence, 57 degrees in Westerly. And here's the look at live pinpoint Doppler. Uh, our live city cam rather 61 degrees the south southwest wind at about six miles an hour we'll widen out and show you what's happening on satellite and radar you can see some clouds streaming through so rather than that mostly sunny sky that we had yesterday we'll see a mix of sun and clouds cold front sitting up to our neck north will drop down south that's our back door front it's going to turn our winds to the east and northeast behind it and that will bring in the cooler air nine o'clock this morning you can see that mixture of clouds and sunshine staying dry for the afternoon and into the this evening, there's a slight chance of a spotty uh, drizzle or a brief light shower during the late evening and overnight hours, but I think much of the time is dry. Maybe some patchy fog again to begin the Tuesday morning commute at 6 a.m. It's mostly cloudy and we'll keep an eye on a shower mostly during the morning hours with clouds uh, continuing to linger for Tuesday afternoon, though we may see some breaks of sun second half of the day. Patchy fog for this morning, mild with a temperature between 60 and 70. In the afternoon, we're looking at highs in the mid to upper 70s. It's a warm one, Lincoln and North Providence for the end of September. Downtown in the upper 70s will be in the mid 70s. Barrington and Riverside about 78 at T of Green Airport, 77 in Warwick. The coast looks like the mid 70s. Newport, Charlestown and Wickford near 76, a mix of clouds and sunshine. Further inland will be in the mid to upper 70s, not as hot as yesterday, but still warm and dry. Mid 70s in Situate and Foster in southeastern Mass. Uh, you're looking at a partly sunny day. Mid to upper 70s, not a bad start to the work week. Fall River near 76, Little Compton at about 76 degrees. Here's the seven day future cast, and I do have a spotty shower in the forecast for Tuesday and Wednesday. Again, it's nothing that you can bank on for giving those lawns and gardens a drink, but the temperature is again dropping a good 10 plus degrees from the highs today to what we're looking at for Tuesday and Wednesday, and we're talking about 20 degree temperature change from what we just had over the weekend. Thursday's high near 65, morning clouds and then some brightening in the afternoon, and we'll find that again on Friday. Saturday, we've got a cold front that'll come through, so some showers potentially right now. Highest risk would be in the morning hours.